एजद अहमद साहब ने पूछा है और ये इनफैक्ट ये भी बहुत अच्छा कमेंट है इनका मैं पूरा पढ़ूंगा क्योंकि इट्स वर्थ रीडिंग द होल होल ईमेल आई एम टीचिंग प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजमेंट इन इन कॉलेज इन किचनर इट इज अ मैटर ऑफ ग्रेट कंसर्न दैट आवर दैट अदर कंट्री स्टूडेंट्स आर टेकिंग फुल एडवांटेज ऑफ द कैनेडियन स्टूडेंट वीजा प्रोसेस बट पाकिस्तान इज लैगिंग बिहाइंड इन दिस एस्पेक्ट डिस्पाइट बीइंग ऑन द फास्ट ट्रैक प्रोग्राम व्हाट स्टेप्स आर द पाकिस्तान कंसुलेट्स टेकिंग to improve this situation and here are some suggestions from mr azad ahmed aur azad ahmed sab maujood bhi hain hamari is meeting ka hissa bhi hain i am very happy azad sahab ka jo hai mujhe bhi agar aap ye email mujhe bhi forward kijiyega to i will be grateful ji main bilkul aur lekin main inke wo bahut acche suggestions hain wo padhna chahunga yahan pe is forum pe his suggestions include awareness seminars to be arranged on zoom and in person for students and parents most students focus on scholarships and university admission but they should be aware of the opportunity for students in colleges work with immigration consultants to find root cause for low applications and denial of visas lobby the federal government to determine why pakistani student visas are denied focus on improving the number of applications and reduce denials arrange funding in pakistan banks for 10000 dollar gic deposit which is requirement for the visa arrange soft loans for students applying for admission this is a major factor contact the main colleges in ontario canada and ensure that pakistan is targeted in their marketing efforts promote settlement support to pakistani students after they get visas very comprehensive this is very genuine concern increasing the number of pakistani students in canada is one of our primary focus areas as high commissioner earlier indicated when he visited uh, toronto last weekend uh, he uh, highlighted his priorities and education was his first priority pakistan was included in the sts list countries in july 2019 that was the time when the admissions for all semester fall semester had already been completed and the earliest pakistani students could apply was the next spring semester but unfortunately covid pandemic hit the world in late 2019 and early 2020 20 and the application processing for all types of visas slowed down the processing time for student visa application was considerably prolonged and resultantly many students who had other options available chose to follow those instead of coming to canada according to canada's official statistics the total number of pakistani students that got their study permits in 2020 is low as compared to the student permit issued for applicants from other sts eligible countries we have repeatedly raised this matter with the canadian authorities so much so that foreign minister shahmoud qureshi also urged the canadian foreign minister to ease the visa regime for pakistani students and businessmen during their recent telephone conversation your suggestions are very valuable and well thought of uh, we have held zoom meetings with several leading canadian universities and gain their insight on how the numbers can be improved we have also uh, arranged uh, brock university's mou with sofa university in karachi recently and the idea was to increase the number of students uh, as a result of, uh, of implementation of that mou we are also working on holding a comprehensive webinar on education including sds program with all stakeholders we would love Uh, that uh, that you will also be part of that uh, webinar when we uh, when we uh, hold it in the near future colonel nasir hussain malik if you if you, if you would allow me butra sir yeah 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 please go ahead sir uh, ek to the uh, ezad sahab ka bahut shukriya uh, that he uh, showed this concern or hum uh, uh, jaise butra sahab ne aur agar ezad sahab sun rahe hain to i am addressing him कि जैसे भोटा साहब ने कहा हम लोग इसको बहुत इस पे फोकस करना चाह रहे हैं एजुकेशनल जो एस्पेक्ट है और उसमें जैसे इन्होंने अभी मेंशन भी किया हम भी वी आर एमिंग एट नेक्स्ट ईयर सितंबर का जो सेशन है उसके ऊपर उसके लिए इफ आई अंडरस्टैंड करेक्टली द 
uh, the application processes would be finalized by March next year. So uh, that leaves us with uh, very little time that we have to give children awareness if there is some facilitation or uh, counseling, we have to do that. So uh, we would really love to uh, hear about some ideas that we can in all these things to fast track. Uh, uh, hum ek, uh, we are uh, uh, aiming at a, 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 a webinar, a uh, education expo, a road show uh, in November, sorry, uh, November and December and if possible in, in January. ताके हम जो एक ये ये भोटा साहब कहते होते हैं इकोसिस्टम डेवलप कर लें कर कर पाएं कि जिसमें हमारे बच्चे जो हैं वो फैसिलिटेट हो सके तो साहब आप प्लीज आप एम्बेसी से भी राता कीजिए भोटा साहब से भी राते में रहिए एंड वी वुड रियली एप्रिशिएट कि अगर आप इसमें हमें हमारे साथ कोई कंट्रीब्यूट करें इन बाय वे ऑ